now I'm fixing to apply a spit coat of some one pound blonde shellac. What I have is denatured alcohol, BLO, bull linseed oil, and good old seal coat. It's easy, it's pre-mixed, I don't have to mess with it. I made a small pad out of some cheesecloth and rubber band. I'm going to pre-wet it just a touch, get a little moisture in it. Just keep everything as wet as you can. And put some oil on it. Let that soak in. And it's damp. Then I'm going to take the piece I'm going to work on, demonstrations will work on one of these first. I'm going to put a drop or two of oil down. Go ahead and get my shellac on my pad. Stick it in the oil. Start rubbing. We've got a lot of fluid here. A little too much actually. But as the alcohol evaporates, it will come down. Circles, figure eights. What you look what you're looking for is just a build up. Get my edges. It doesn't matter about swirl marks. You want to finish with the grain. And that is applied. Hi folks. A couple of tips or tricks or tricks and tips on files. Um, when you've used your file and you've got debris in the teeth, it's not good to go at it with another piece of steel to clean it. What I like to do is take a piece of copper and flatten it down on the end. If you set it on top of the file and you start it back and forth, it will wear teeth into it and comb it out. And you can just walk on down the file. And get the debris out. You got a stubborn piece, stand it on its edge, use the corner get the stubborn piece out. Once you've done that, then you can go to a brass brush and clean it up real nice. Same with your rasps. I flipped it over on the other side And work at it a bit. It takes a little bit to get that comb started. And same way, stubborn piece or debris. And then I can turn it this way. Work it as well this way. The copper won't damage it at all. brass won't damage it at all either. It's always a lot better that way. 
Now this one is old, it's pitted. I rescued it out of a barn, but it's still got some good life left in it. Now when they're dull, get you a trough that will accept the length of the iron, the file and um, put, fill it with white vinegar. Set it in there, let it soak overnight. What it does is enough acid that it'll get a little etch, a little bit of a more of an edge on the top of your file. Pull it out while I brush it off, oil it a slight little bit. Now it's going to be darker, it's going to turn it a little bit black, but you don't change any of the quality of the hardness of the steel and it'll have a little bit more bite to it again. That's it. Thank mm -hmm. you.